All right, so first let's identify our ring structure. So this is one, two, three, four, five, six. This is a six carbon structure, right? So cyclohexane. So we can get rid of A and D because those are not cyclohexane. So now let's look at our substituent groups. We have two methyl groups, one here and one here. So these are methyl. And then I have one ethyl group right here. We start numbering from ethyl because of the alphabetical order. And then I want the numbering to be the lowest for my substituent group. So I should go counterclockwise um, to get the lowest numbers there. So there's the numbering. If I had gone the other direction, I would have gotten one, two, three, four, and this would have been carbon five and carbon six. Okay, so let's see. We need one ethyl, which means our answer is C, but let's make sure two, three, dimethyl. So two, three, our methyl. So two, three, dimethyl, cyclohexane is correct. So the answer here is C.